Alexander. Welcome, Ricori Boys basketball fans. Tonight, the Spartans are playing host to the Delano Tigers. It's Tuesday, January the 15th, and tonight's game is being played in the old high school gym. It's now referred to as a middle school gym. So, lots of tradition, lots of memories here in the old in the old gym. Uh, Delano Tigers in town tonight. Delano coming in as one of the uh, top teams in the section. Starting lineups being introduced. I'll give them to you uh, um, as I have them here. Guests on the scoreboard, Delano Tigers. Number five is Derek Techum. He's a six foot senior. Number 11, Trey Longstreet. He's a six five sophomore. Number 12 is Keegan Smith. He's a six five junior. 22 is Reno Bradal. He's a 6'2 senior. And number 52, Max Otto, a 6'4 junior. Techum, Longstreet, Smith, Bradal, and Otto for the Delano Tigers. For the Spartans, it's number 5, Corbin Alexander. He's a 6'3 senior. Number 11, Brett Zawada. He's a 5'11 junior. 13 is Andrew Anderson, 6'4 junior. 24, Mason Roos, a 6'6 senior. And 42, Luke Humbert. He's a 6'1 sophomore. Alexander and Sawada in the backcourt. Anderson, Roos, and Humbert in the front court for the Spartans. I mentioned earlier uh, Delano coming in as one of the top teams in the section. Spartans and the Tigers in the same sectional playoffs at the end. Tigers recently uh, beat Sock Rapids by about 30 points. They put up 108 points in that game. So Spartans are going to have their hands full here. Longstreet with it. Kicks it on the uh, wing to Bredahl and then right inside quickly, Max Otto with an easy two. And it's 2 0. Tigers with the early lead. Sawada penetrates, picks up his dribble. And gets it to Humbert. Humbert on the far wing now skips it for Anderson. Humbert just drops it for Sawada. Backdoor Humbert had it if he went right up with it. It's not going to count. Instead, the foul is going to be on 22. Reno Bradall. So unfortunately, Spartans had a uh, had a scoring opportunity wiped off with that foul. Now Roos swings into the lane and he gets it. Both teams with a two-point basket with their first possession. Techum just kind of muscles it into the lane and gets the runner to go, and it's four to two. Anderson, now Sawada with it. Humbert, it dumps it in, into the block to Roos, and travel is called on Roos. First turnover on the Spartans. 16.35 to go, four to two. Tigers with the early lead, Longstreet. Now swinging around the horn, Bradall now back right down to Longstreet, and he missed the shot. Actually, that was Smith that missed it. Sawada right down the lane, missed the layup. Techum now bounces it. Strong move to the basket, no good by Smith. Roos with the rebound. Kick it ahead to Humbert. Now Alexander, top of the key, Humbert with it now. Luke from about 15, pulls up, got it. One thing you'll notice here, the rims are a lot softer, a lot looser, they're gonna get, boy, that's gonna, oh. Techum just ran over Sawada and the foul is gonna go on Sawada on the block call. I mentioned the rims much looser. They're gonna be much more forgiving to the shooters. Oh, 
Four to four, right off the inbound, it's Smith. Sawada breaks the press, now Humbert with it. Top of the key, Roos. Alexander open for three, missed it. Otto with the rebound, he leaves it for Tekum. Tried to kick it ahead to Longstreet, it's knocked out of bounds by Anderson. Number three, Blake Miller in for the Spartans. Otto with it. Tech on top of the key. And the foul is gonna go on Sawada, and that's two on Brett. Philippi, the sophomore, is gonna come off the bench for Sawada. Otto bounces it far side. Skip back to Long Street, right down the lane. A little up and under shot, and didn't know that he don't know that he had to do that. Philippi thought about it, pulled it back down. Now Roos. And that one's gonna be a charge. Wow. So two turnovers on the Spartans. Coach Peterson, I'm sure was telling the ref there it was a different call down here when Tecum ran Sawada over. Tecum into the lane, all the way to the basket, missed it. Anderson with the rebound. Kicks it ahead to Miller. Roos gets it down on the block. He traveled, nothing called. Miller gets it now. Skip it for Alexander. Corbin into the lane, lost it. Tipped it out to Anderson. Three-pointer is no good. Alexander with the rebound. Back to Anderson. Spins in the lane and he got it. Quickly back the other way. Smith opening the corner, missed it. Anderson high up for the rebound, and wow. Foul's gonna go on Roos, I think. Foul's on 24, That's two on Roos, and that's gonna bring Dylan Roush into the game. 23, Dylan Roush, a 6'4 senior. Auto with it, spin it around to Long Street. Right down the lane, they kick it back out to Smith. Tech him now. My runner, and wow. There's that soft rim we were talking about. Tech him with four, and it's 8 6. Delano with a two point lead. Roush, top of the key, now Miller. Both teams open in a man defense. Spartans have played man almost the whole season. Ooh, and travel in there, missed it at first. Three turnovers now on the Spartans. Too easy, Smith. Smith with four. That's 10 6 Delano by four. Alexander, long three is no good. Long rebound comes out to Otto. Tech him quickly ahead to Long Street. Oh, he just stays solid. He would have ran you over. Smith with the easy two. 
He is six, and now the Tigers are do doubled up on the Spartans, 12-6. They break the press, they're coming three on two. Alexander drops it for Roush, he can't get it to go. Alexander gets it back, no good. Longstreet clears it for Tecum. Into the front court, crosses over now, pulls it back out, gets it back. Little hesitation dribble, got the nice left-handed reverse. Tecum with six and it's 14-6. Delano by eight. Roush with it, far side, back out on top for Anderson. We're Spartans standing around here, nothing, nobody's cutting, nobody's moving anything. And now Phillippe took it to the basket because nobody's moving and a foul is going to be called on the Tigers and Coach Peterson wants a timeout. Timeout on the floor with 11.03 to go. It's Delano 14 and Ricori 6. back after the Spartan timeout. It'll be Spartans ball underneath their own basket. It's 14-6. Delano by eight. Coach Peterson, I'm sure, did not like the fact that the Spartans were just standing around that last possession. And I'm sure he talked about that at the timeout. Taryn O'Neill, number 20, has checked in for the Tigers. And Miller picked up his pivot. Four turnovers now on the Spartans. Otto all alone, man. Somebody got picked. It's 16-6 now. Delano by 10. 10.25 to go. Phillippe bounces it to Holkinson. Stolen away by Longstreet, coming the other way. Phillippe knocked it out of bounds. So it'll stay with the Tigers. All right, Otto inbound it underneath their own basket. Longstreet got tied up with Anderson, got it in though. Longstreet gets it back. Now Tech on top of the key. Swinging around O'Neill. Tech him wide open for three, and I think we're going to get an illegal screen on the Tigers. So it'll be the first turnover on Delano. All goes on Otto. Anderson bounces it into Roush. Phillippe wide open for three, missed it. And Rebound comes down to Anderson. Now inside Humbert, who's checked back in. Off the glass is good. Foul's going to go on Philip. Techum gets the first one, he has seven. 
17-8. And he got them both to make it 18. Roos checks back in for Roush. So Roos back in the game with those two fouls. Humbert on the far side, being hounded by O'Neal. Now gets the top of the key to Roos. Wilkinson with the left-handed dribble, pulls it back out. Now Humbert. Knocked away by O'Neal, and he couldn't save it right in front of the Tiger bench before it went out of bounds, so it'll be Spartan basketball. Our side, right in front of the Delano bench. Bruce gets the top of the key and just hands it off to Humbert. Hawkins it down the lane, left hander off the glass. It's good. It's 18-10, Delano by eight. Uh, in the lane, too easy, that's Dylan Hall, who's just checked in, and it's 20 to 10 now. Tigers by 10. Hokinson, baseline, right back to Roos, a little give and go, gets his guy up. Awkward shot, no good. Hokinson had the rebound. Lost it, but it was last touch by O'Neal. So it'll stay with the Spartans. 20 to 10, 8.04 to go here in the first half. Phillip, he bounced past to Humbert, lost it. Turnover on the Spartans. Here come the Tigers with Longstreet. Attack on long three is short. Rebound comes out to Longstreet. Back out to Tecum, little hesitation dribble. And they kick it back out, Tecum gets it back. O'Neal with it. Boy, off the glass and good, nice runner. By Taryn O'Neal, his first points. That's 22-10. Tigers by 12. Three-pointer, Holkinson, no good. Otto with the rebound. Leaves it for Tecum. And a foul is gonna go on Holkinson, and that's, I think that's two on Tucker. First foul on Tucker. Longstreet gets it in. That was Hall with it. Now Tecum gets it back. Spin around to Otto. Now Longstreet takes a baseline. Tried to drop it to Halls. One of the Spartans got a hand on it, and it's a turnover on the Tigers. Holkinson all the way to the basket. Got it. Tech on the runner, coming right back, in and out, no good. Hokinson with the rebound. Fires it ahead to Humbert. Now in the corner, Phillippe, three-pointer, no good, missed everything. Hall with the air ball rebound, and he leaves it for Techum. Boy, off the glass, no good. Anderson came over and altered his shot. Now Humbert in the corner, 6.05 to go here. Oh, that's gonna be stolen away by Longstreet. Coming in, I thought he was gonna dunk it, but he just laid it up. First points for Longstreet. That's a couple of steals he has on that very same thing. Too long of a cross-court pass. Longstreet stepped in and picked it off. Bruce better be careful he doesn't pick up his third foul. Humbert can't get it. 
Paul with the rebound. And here's Tecum. Five and a half to go here. Tecum splits the defense, can't get it, but tip put back by Dylan Hall is good. That's 26-12, Tigers by 14. Boy, quick three by Anderson, no good. That's too quick of a shot there. Runner by Hall, no good, and the foul is going to go on one of the Spartans. Foul goes on Anderson, that's his first foul. Corbin Alexander checks back in along with Brett Sawada. Taryn O'Neill at the line, 6'4 junior. Got them both. He has four in the game. That's 28-12 now. Tigers by 16, it's their biggest lead of the game. Humbert bounces it into Roos. Roos wasted his dribble, now he threw it away. Stolen away by Otto, and the foul is gonna go on Holkinson. And that's gonna be two fouls on Tucker Holkinson. So, Holkinson, Sawada, and Roos, all three on the floor with two fouls. Max Otto gets the first one. He has five in the game. Six different Tigers have scored in the game so far, and he got them both. Tecum at seven, uh, we got a timeout. So, 4.34 to go here. It is Delano 30 and the Spartans 12. All right, we're back after the Spartan timeout. 30 to 12, Delano by 18. We still have four and a half minutes to go here in the first half. Alexander leaves it for Roos, nice pass. So good feed by Alexander, Mason has four. And it's 30 to 14, 4.05 to go now. Right, lob, the set play. They lobbed it on the baseline to Longstreet. He is four. Three thirty-five to go now. Spartans down by eighteen. Roos chucks up a three, in and out, no good. Nobody home for the Spartans. Easy rebound for Max Otto and the Tigers. Spartans in a 3-2 zone now. Boy, Longstreet, just a give and go, missed the shot. Otto kicks it out for O'Neal, three-pointer, got the kind roll. O'Neal was seven off the bench. That's 35-14. Delano by nine by twenty-one. Roos with it. Spins off the glass, no good. Otto with a bunch of rebounds here in the first half gets another one. O'Neill thought about it, pulled it back down. Tecum leaves it for O'Neill. Into the corner now, Tecum. Three pointer in and out, no good. Rebound comes out to Sawada. Alexander, now Roos, he'll take a three, and he got that one. Hey, 
Bruce with seven, it's 35-17. Delano by 18. Tecum looking to answer back, no good. Humbert with the rebound and the foul. He's gonna go on, I believe it's Otto. Oh boy, Luke. Just the fourth foul on Delano, so no free throws. Second foul on Otto. Coming up on two minutes to go right now in the first half. Delano by 18. Humbert, little jab step, and then he fired up the air ball. Quickly ahead, it's Longstreet. Back out, Tecum. And Humbert almost got the steal far side, but he couldn't corral it before it went out of bounds, so it'll stay with the Tigers. Longstreet, little runner. They're just running that give and go with the from the guard entry pass to the forward, then he just goes right to the basket. Longstreet with six now. And it's 37-17. Alexander with the miss. Roos wrestles the rebound away. Now Sawada. Boy. Could have got an offensive foul there, nothing called. And now a foul is going to go on O'Neill. Foul's on the tiger, number 20, Jared O'Neill. That's his second. And now another hold is going to go on Longstreet. That'll be just the sixth Delano foul. One minute to go here in the first half. Delano by 20. Shut up, no good. Rebounded by Hall. Fifty seconds to go. Lob it in to Hall. Tecum had it, pulled it back down into Hall again. 35 seconds. Boy, that's too easy. Wow. Nice pass by Longstreet. Easy basket for Hall. He has six. Nine seconds left. Alexander from about 16, can't get it. Hall with the rebound. Tecum one second, he launches it and almost went, no good. So the halftime horn sounds and it's Delano 39, Ricori 17. They can hear you, so it's okay. It's okay. You can bring me like a steak sandwich tomorrow. Okay. Okay. All right, Spartans with the first possession. Sawada give and go. Trey Anderson gets it back off the glass and in. So Sawada with his first points of the game. And it's 39-19 now. Tigers by 20. And that's going to be a turnover, backcourt violation. I had Delano for only two turnovers the first half, and there's their first of the second half. The most impressive thing, they had six players score, two players with seven, and four players with six points. So that's what you call balanced scoring for the Tigers. Roos had seven to lead the Spartans. So Spartans need to peck away at this lead here. They're down by 20. Humbert tries to get a pick from Roos. Now Mason 
gets to the basket, missed it, gets his own rebound. Man, go back up. Sawada for three, missed it. Rebounded by Keegan Smith. Inside Smith, little bounce pass tech, and wow. Somehow got it to go, and we got a timeout. Delano. Timeout on the floor, 16.47 to go. It's Delano 41 in the Spartans. Physical body language he was seeing from his players. At least that's what the way I saw it. They turned it over on the first possession, and the second one they were just standing around watching. You see how they come out of the timeout. And Spartans turn it over, so they get a turnover. Delano does in their first possession. All right, tech them into the front court. Off the glass and in for Longstreet. Longstreet with eight. That's 43-19. Tigers by 24. Roos from 16, missed it. Humbert got the rebound. Alexander went down, Humbert. Luke was six in the game, it's turnover now. Here comes Sawada. And Alexander, far side to Humbert. Well, Sawada down to Humbert, nice pass. Nice feed from Sawada to Humbert. And it's 43-23. Humbert with eight in the game. Techum, now Breedall. Longstreet bounces it to Otto. Now three-pointer Breedall in and out, no good. Bruce tipped the rebound, needs to grab it. Techum, no good. And rebound went over the head of Breedall. And here come the Spartans, 43-23. Boy, he had Roos on the roll, didn't get, didn't see him. Humbert with it now. Alexander for three, no good. And Longstreet with the rebound just brings it into the front court. They kick it out for Otto. Otto gets it back high post and I'll tech him. Otto with it, hands it back to tech him and they're gonna reset. Again, no shot clock in high school basketball. Tech him, chucks a three, that's off. And uh, Roos with the rebound, leaves it for Sawada. One-handed pass to Anderson, quick shot, missed it badly, wow. You shoot it that quick, you can't miss that badly. That's like a turnover. Now here comes Delano all alone, it's Smith. And we're gonna get a timeout. Timeout on the floor. 13.43 to go, it's Delano 45 and Ricori 23. All right, back after the timeout. 13.40 to go now here in the second half. It's Delano by 22, they had a 22 point lead at the half. Pull up Sawada, good looking shot, got it. Hey, nice shot, Brett. Brett has four and it's back to a 20 point margin. Techum three, got it. Techum with 12. And it's a 23 point lead now for Delano. Techum, that's the first three that he got. He's kind of known for his three point shooting. Kind of an awkward looking shot. Kind of shoots it from the hip. And now the foul is going to go on Techum. Techum, a three year starter. Alexander comes out, Philippi in for the Spartans. 
in the meeting with the partners on the 45 lead building. Humbert skips it for Philippi. Sawada right down the lane. Stops, pulls up, can't get it, but the foul. I think is gonna go on Tecum again. So a couple quick ones on Tecum. So the junior, Brett Sawada, at the line to shoot two. First one to rims out. Two for Sawada, he has five, all here in the second half. 48-26 now, 12 and a half to go, and the Tigers almost turn it over, but Otto gets it back. They zoom in on Kenny on the bench over there. Just for a second. All right, 12.20 to go now. Tigers by 22. And they turn it over. Right, Roos with it. Out here on the wing, now top of the key, Humbert. 12 minutes to go right now. Spartans down by 22. That was the halftime deficit. Philippi shot up no good. Hey, you're good, Jim. Greedall with the rebound, and he leaves it for Tecum. Little stop and go by Tecum. Kicks it back out for Longstreet. Check him from the corner, got it. Check him with 15, the only player in double figures for either team. So a lot of double team, still has it, now gets it out to Miller. No spacing there. Sawada's gonna get a foul here. So it's a turnover on the Spartans. The runner is good for Tecum. Tecum was 17. And Sawada just threw it away. Boy. And we're gonna get a timeout. Timeout on the floor. 10.47 to go. It's Delano 53, Spartans 26. All right, we're back. Taryn O'Neill, number 20 with the ball in for the Tigers along with 35, Dylan Hall. Dylan Rouse just checked in for the Spartans. All the way to the basket, and the charge. Charge is going to be called on the Tigers. All right, so the ref under the basket called a charge, and probably rightfully so. One of the top officials said that Philippi took the charge in the arc. So that's a new rule this year. You have to be outside the arc. So we're going to count the basket. And I think that was... It 
Is that Hall with the three point play? We're going to give it to Hall. So he has nine. Meanwhile, Otto whistled for a foul down here on the other end, and Humbert will be at the line shooting two. Twelve, Keegan Smith back in for the Tigers. Tigers have only played seven players tonight. Six of the seven have six points or more. Humbert gets the second one. He has nine in the game. Check him, the runner, and he got it. Tech him with 19. 10 minutes to go right now. Tigers up by 31, 58 27. Phillippe, three, in and out, no good. Roush had a hand on the rebound, but it went to O'Neill. Now quickly ahead, Otto. Smith, lefty three, and he got it. Keegan Smith with 11. Holkinson, top of the key to Humbert. Pull up, got it. And so Humbert with 11, and I think the foul is gonna be on Delano after the shot. It's on Otto, so it's after the shot, so we're gonna count the basket, and then the Spartans will have the basketball underneath their own basket. So a chance for a four or five point possession here. They did count the basket. Foul was on the rebound, that's why they got it. Holkinson was six, and it is a, indeed a four point possession that time for the Spartans, 61-31. Need a lot more of that in a short amount of time though as Hall dips into the middle and then spins back off the glass. He has 11. And it's 63-31. Dallano by 32. Humbert drives baseline. Hey, good baseline drive. Came to the jump stop and then just missed the shot. Corner Smith tried to get it in. Miller knocked it away though. And hey, this time, Smith runs over Humbert and it's outside the arc, so it's going to be a turnover on the Tigers. Anderson in the game now gives it, tried to get it to Holkinson and went off his hands out of bounds. Looked like Tucker wasn't ready for it, wasn't looking for it, so it's a turnover on the Spartans. Smith fires it over to Hall, now uh, Otto with it. Hall. Back to Otto. Number two, Caleb Harris into the game for the first time for the Tigers. And out of bounds, last touch by the Spartans. O'Neill to inbound it, gets it into Smith. Tried to lob it into Otto, and that wasn't even close. Tough pass there by Harris, and it's turnover on the Tigers. 
7.25 to go here. 63-31. Tigers by 32 points here. Almost knocked away. Roush gets it. Now he does. They do lose it. It's an errant pass by Roush turns into a turnover. Harris, little change of direction, gives it to Hall. And he's going to go to the line to shoot two. Dylan Hall at the line gets the first one. He has 12 in the game. 55 Seth Wiest in the game for the Tigers. 6'5 senior. Hokinson with the missed free throw. Anderson pull up off the glass, no good. Harris with it, top of the key, Smith. O'Neal, runner off the glass is good. Sixty-six thirty-one. Delano by 35, and we might have running time here the rest of the six minutes and 15 seconds. And a whistle, and the clock will keep running. Foul is going to go on Harris. Subs in the game, number one, Sam Kern for the Tigers. 25, Nick Brady. Wilkinson gets it to Roush. Now Miller with it. Philippi in the corner to Miller. And now the foul is going to go on Caleb Harris. And that's going to be one and one for Blake Miller. Again, there's a rule in high school basketball. If it's a 35-point lead with nine minutes or less, the clock will run. So the clock is running while we're getting ready for Miller's free throws. 5-10 to go now in the game. Blake got the first one. Thirty-three Charlie Matuska and fifty-three Mark Bicknell in for the Spartans. Number three Garrett Robinson in for the Tigers. Miller got them both. Sixty-six thirty-three. The Tigers doubled up on the Spartans. Three pointer is good for Harris. And it's 69-33. Matuska tried to answer back and the ball got wedged between the backboard and the rim. Four minutes to go right now. 21, Kenny Davis in the game for the Spartans along with number 15, Gage Peel. Inside the Wiest, and he got it. Nice lefty out the glass. Bicknell, top of the key, stolen away by Kern. Tried to shovel it in to Brady, and it was knocked away, and it, here come the Spartans. And it's going to stay with the Spartans. 3.20 to go now. Clock is running. Three 
305, Davis in the Matuska. Chief in the game, number 31. Paul and Eskew. Davis with the steal, all the way to the basket, can't get it. And he's going to go to the line to shoot two. We're at 240. And again, the clock's running. Kenny Davis, the senior, at the line shooting two. First one's no good. Second one is short. 2.10 to go now. Pull up three for Robinson is no good. Matuska with the rebound. Two minutes to go right now. Peel is open for three. He's going to chuck it. It's blocked. Weist with the rebound. Tried to get it ahead. It's going to go off the foot of Matuska. So it'll be Delano basketball. Minute 40 to go. Kern kicks it out. Shot no good by Brady. Kenny Davis with the rebound. Leaves it for Matuska. Eskew, no good, and he's gonna go line to shoot too. Come on, Chief! Come on, Chief! 120, clock's running. Foul on the deck is number one, Sam Kern. Let's first. Got the roll. Colin with his first point. That might be the first point of his varsity career. Second one, no good. Brady with the rebound. Leaves it for Kern. Into the lane, lost it. Here comes Peel, two on one with Davis. Tried to, tried to get it to Davis, but now. 25 seconds. 71-36. Spartans down by 35, 19, and they're just gonna hold it now. Kern with it, now nine seconds. Three seconds, and that's gonna do it. All right, so the final horde sounds with the score, Delano 71 and Ricori 36.